With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. The question is, a circus tent is cylindrical to a height of 8 meter surmounted by a conical part. If the total height of the tent is 13 meter and the diameter of its base is 24 meter, calculate the area of canvas required to make this tent allowing 10% of the canvas used for folds and stitching. Okay, this part is important. 10% of the canvas used for folds and stitching. Okay, now let's find out. Okay, so before that, let's draw the diagram of this question. This is the diagram for this question. Okay, so this is the entire tent here. We can see the cylindrical part, which is a height of 8 meter and the radius of 12 meter. As the diameter is given as 24, that means the radius will be 12 meter. So the diameter equals to 24 meter which means radius will be 24 divided by 2 divided by 2 meter which is equal to 12 meter okay so as we have got this radius to be 12 meter this radius will also be 12 meter and the total height of the tent is given as 13 meter the cylindrical part has a height of 8 meter that means the conical part has the height of 5 meter okay so now what we have to find out we have to find out the this height okay this is what called this is called the slant height of the cone okay so for that here we can use the Pythagoras theorem here we can see that this part is 12, this part is 5. So the height, uh, the length of this part will be how much? According to the Pythagoras theorem, perpendicular square plus base square will be equal to hypotenuse square. So this is 90 degree angle here and this is hypotenuse. So hypotenuse square, that means the length of this, it will be root under this one square plus this one square. That means root under 5 square plus 12 square. Okay. So first of all, let's write from here, you can write. Therefore, the first thing we need to understand that what is the slant height of the cone. So we have to find out the slant height. Slant height. Slant height of the of the cone. This will be equals to root under 5 square plus 12 square, which will be root under 169. 5 square is 25, 12 square is 144. In total, they will make 169, which is 13 meter. Okay. Now here we have got the slant height of the cone. That means now we can easily find out the total area of the tent. Okay. So we can write from here. Therefore, total surface area, uh, total surface area of the of the tent. Okay. So total surface area of the tent will be equals to what? This will be equals to the surface area. Look at this. This is the uh, curved surface area of the cylinder plus curved surface area of the cone. Okay. So we can write from here. Carved surface of cylinder plus cone okay so total curve surface area we have to find out okay so for cylinder the formula is pi r h 2 pi r h sorry it is 2 pi r h plus for the cone it is pi r l okay so from here we can take uh, pi r common it will be pi r multiplied by 2 h plus l Okay, now if we know the value for, uh, value for H, which is the height of the cone, uh, cylinder, sorry, height of the cylinder, which is given as 8 meter, and L is the slant height, or it can be written as L. Okay, so this is the value of L, and R is what? R is the radius. Okay, so if we put the value, it will be, so now we can easily put the value. The value for pi is 22 divided by 7, multiply, the value for R is 12, multiplied by 2 H. That means 2 into height of the cylinder, which is 2 into 8, which is 16, 2 into 8, let's write plus L, the value for L is 13. So if we simplify it, it will be 22 divided by 7 multiplied by 12 multiplied by this will be 16 plus 13, which will make 29. Okay. So if we further solve it, it will be equals to 7, 6, 5, 6 divided by 7 meter square. Okay. This is the total surface area of the tent. Now what we have to find out, we have to find out the total area of the canvas. Okay. So here in the question, it is given that the area used for stitching and folds are is the 10% uh, of the total area so from here you can write that therefore area used for folds and stitching and stitching equals to 10% of area area of 10% of area of canvas okay so from here you can write that therefore total area of canvas therefore total area 
of canvas the total area of canvas will be equals to what total curved surface area plus this area for stitching okay so this will be equals to total curved surface area means what this is uh, let's write it total uh, area of tent area of tent here we mean the surface area okay total surface area let me write that s dot area that means the surface area okay plus here we need to add the area used for the stitches plus area for area for folds and stitches okay so the value for this we know it is equals to seven six five six divided by seven plus this is what this is 10 percent of the area of the canvas okay so let's say the area of canvas is what x okay so this will be equals to x into 10 divided by 100 this is a 10 percent if we bring this on the left hand side what will it do what it will become from here it can be written as x minus this value is what x divided by 10 so it will be x minus x divided by 10 here x means what x means the total area of the canvas okay this equals to 7656 divided by 7 from here if we take the lcm this will be 10 so it will be 10x minus x 10x minus x divided by 10 the lcm is 10 is equal to 7656 divided by 7 10x minus x is what 9x okay so from here we can find that this will be 9x divided by 10 equals to 7656 divided by 7 okay so from here we can find out easily find out the value for x therefore x will be equal to what 7656 multiplied by this value will be multiplied that means 10 divided by 9 into 7 okay if we further solve it this will be equals to 1 2 1 5 uh, uh, point, point 2 3 meter square so this is the x that means the total area of the canvas this is what we have to find so this is the required solution for this question thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today